Hello and welcome to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa. Um, if this is your first time of joining, we are basically an entertainment analysis show that does it harder than anybody else. We break down all the celebrity gist and invite the amazing talents that are out there doing their thing in the entertainment space. Um, and when I say we, I have two co-anchors with me, fantastic people that analyze us. They give us the bass boost, keeping it jiggy with me, absolutely. Our two men, um, dominated girls. And they are Ifelo Shike and Quincy Jones. Hello, people. Is there anything you guys don't blame on the man? I did tell you. Is it a blame? It's like, is it, yes, it's no. a matter of fact. You're dominated it's, by it's me. A, what is the matter like, of it's fact? Like, it's like, when I'm here with two women, I don't come up and say, I, I am Ifelo or Shike. And yeah, I'm you do. You say you say women. you have two beautiful ladies and, and no two men. Two beautiful da, 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 da. ladies. I never say no. Domination men. is always a bad thing if every life. It doesn't have to be a bad thing. Must we take the blame? Must we take the fall? Who is giving you a blame? Um. I saw the old Sheishe, which we're going to get to, by the way. And somebody was like, um, this is just a woman trying to thrive in the male-dominated industry and everybody. And then one guy just commented, what doesn't a man take the fall for? Mm. So Sheishe is misbehavior. We so take you, the fall. because you read the comment now, you think that implies in every aspect of your because life. that's what you guys Benny, do. You go and sit Benny, down. Or Benny, Please, or Benny, Nigerian or Benny music you understand? star Sheishe, since if he wants to jump, got more than she bargained. After she was dragged on Twitter for criticizing a contestant on Nigerian Idols, the music reality show's sixth um, season kicked off on Sunday with Shay Shay, DJ Sosi, and Obi Asika as a judge. On its first episode on Sunday, March 28th, Shay Shay was accused of bullying and criticizing, or well, I say over criticizing because you're allowed to criticize, over criticizing a 17 year old contestant after his performance. Somebody lied to you, she said. Somebody told you to come here and audition. You should go back and tell them that they aren't your friends because that was not good. That was not a good audition. You have a sweet talking voice and it comes out in your singing, but your performance is terrible. This is the part that makes people go crazy. You are never going to make big, you're never going to make money being a singer. I love you. You are so sweet, but you're not a singer. You are not a singer. For songwriting, hit me up. We could talk, but that singing, it is not going to work. Sorry, darling. The music star's comment did not sit well with a lot of Nigerians as she, dragged, as she was dragged on Twitter for being aggressive towards the teenager. There were, I think there were two sets of the, of, the, of, the, of the feedback as well. I think some people just thought she was doing her job, while others thought, you know, she went too far with it. Guys? What do you think? Did she go too far with it? Um, I, I think saying that you would never be, I mean, never say never in general, um, especially when it comes to, like, a, a negative um, connotation to somebody else. That's a bit extreme. Like, you never really know that your never is never, you know? Like, you can think that. I think some people would look at Spin Dalentin and say, you would never be a singer. But the guy is doing his thing because he's is not. Is he doing well? I think so. <laughs> I think so. I mean, he's not, he's not doing bad. He's doing better than a lot of other people. Doing better than who? That, that is a music, an actual musician. What, okay, what does that mean? An actual that is, musician? Speed Dalton is not an actual music. He's, he's a social media sensation slash wannabe musician. Uh, okay, well, Do I you mean, understand? whatever. He's made something out of himself. And some people would tell you that he wasn't going to make anything out of himself. Um, no, no one said that. We no just told him he would never. What I'm saying, okay, so are you saying that somebody... <laughs> <laughs> If no one said you never make anything out of I, I'm pretty sure somebody has, but my, my point oh, wow. remains that you can be looked down upon and people might think that you don't have it, and then you'll be surprised that they can actually do something with themselves. So, does she have a right to say that? But I don't think so. But I think, in the I mean, for what it is, as in like a judge, a judge, a judge show, like you're a judge on a, on a critical based show like that it's mm. not it wasn't like the most awful thing that could have ever happened mm. um i just think when you're sitting there giving comments you can't get carried away you can't get you know in your feels and you're not thinking too deeply about what you're saying i don't think she meant that much harm like she's receiving my opinion mm. you go thank you that's how she felt. You hired her as a judge. She came to do a job. She did a job. If that's how she felt, she's supposed to say how she feels about what you're doing. That's the, I mean, the, the what's it called again? The job description. So if she says, I feel like, you, you know, you're not great at that, yeah, fine. And then plus, she actually touched on songwriting, which is another topic entirely because 
everybody feels like I should be singing instead of um, and they're all neglecting the songwriting a part of the industry which is non-existent to be very honest everybody's a songwriter everybody's a singer which is stupid um yeah did you also watch the performance thank you very much yeah so uh, I don't see anything wrong with watching it all right so you know the problem with people is that everyone thinks um because you're supposed to be because you're in a certain position you don't know what's better do mm. you understand everyone thinks because you're in a certain position mm. you do not know what's better i feel like i am the late larry king i feel like i am the late um fella nicola late? wait now i'm getting there i feel like i am a buka i uh. feel like i am um what's it called ik or, or i'm talking about People that are very, very respected and very successful in this business that I'm into right now, right? So the fact that you call me, Feolu Aoshike, to come and be a judge on a certain level where I have to pick presenters. And because I am where I am right now, it don't mean I don't feel like I am there right now. What are you talking about? Now, hold up. Yeah, I think I get what you're saying, but now, I don't agree up. with this. No, 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 no. Hold because up. she's up there. Now, yeah, no, no, no. I'm getting there, guys. Yeah, don't yeah, be oh, yeah, I'm good now. Do you understand? So if you guys now feel like a shei shei is not successful enough to tell a guy our truth, Thank you. then that's a big problem. Because yeah. me, I look at the shei shei like, yeah, that's where she's at. That's where she is. Is she making um enough uh, headlines as all those other guys you guys are singing your praises no even well, the not blogs, recently our blogs are not saying recently blogs are saying she is a songwriter do you know how many beautiful songs we sing too that was written by shay shay of them actually do you understand she is a songwriter and if she's giving a honest truth i don't see a problem with it because i'm going to bring colin carroll into this because <laughs> uh, yeah obviously. yeah because everybody was saying like oh yeah he's the one who made one direction he's the one that pays for um you and uh, with um, uh, uk got stalin he's the one that does this is the one that's not the deal. The deal is that, do I understand music? Do I understand the logic that comes with it? Do I understand the algorithm of music industry, of the music industry? Do I understand the basics? Yes, Shei Shei does. So if Shei Shei is telling you, you can see, she even told the guy, she give him contracts for DA, but because we know they see beyond our nose. She yeah. give him contract. When it comes yeah. to songwriting, darling, hit me up. She told that guy, but that guy chose to be sober. And not call it shay shay. You say, you say, you say. You understand? I'm saying it broke me emotionally, psychologically. Head gone. Bro, you are living in a country that is broken emotionally and psychologically. You understand? We're all broken. Don't even pin your life problems on shay shay. Nigeria is enough life problems. They don't give that dude a chance in life. Right there. You see. Do you understand? After all of this, if that guy don't own more things, they pop for years. You see, Twitter, no matter what. Shay Shay, can I come and write it? If she can't say no, drag out behind. Do you understand? You see, imagine, imagine, dude, imagine if that guy was a girl. A 17 year old girl. No, we need to be friends now. Ah, this is why our ah, women marry at the age of sixteen. It would have been ridiculous. This is why our oh, women. I don't understand. It what would does have been that mean? We, we wouldn't drag Shay Shay, or we wouldn't. We would oh, drag you her. would over drag her. She would be. They won't be. She won't be dragged morning. like like this mm, now. They the drag her. You don't think she's over dragged so. now? No. <laughs> <laughs> Compared to if it was women a girl. Women don't support women. <laughs> and as you guys, I'll be the first the to say that anyway. No, we won't be. Men the are the ones that always. Men are the ones that always. Right that see, you know what's funny? Do you know the funny thing? Is you see that phrase? It's oh, mostly me, said by women. Do you know the funny mm, thing? But very well, true. Very I'm not about to argue that. In a critic. Can I? Okay, so I, I think that your that your analogy with uh, Samokawa and and Shei is uh, to me doesn't make sense because ah. um, when you're saying that somebody cannot this make you wait, 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 wait. When you say that somebody cannot make music, mm. you can never make music. Mm. You can never make it being a singer, rather. Mm. I think Sam Okawo is in a better position to say that because he makes the singers, right? He has that privilege, um, that backing, that accolade that to um, make that. A songwriter and Sam Okawo, if you think that they're the same thing, then let me just drop this conversation. What you're, what, what you're, what you're doing is you are, you're saying, oh, because... Um, Samokal has been able to uh, fish out artists and make them. Mm. 
right? Is 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 he is he in a better position to say what she, no, she said? No, that's not let what me, I'm saying. Let me explain what that's you That's not what I'm saying. No, 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 don't explain. Money, don't explain. The fact that I have money. money and I can make. You think it's you know, money that I can makes give you the best deal? You think it's money that makes you a, a, give you a best money. deal? Are you I serious? Give, I can give you the money, best deal because it's of not my money. money and my connections not, and the people that I know. No, 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 And let's okay. I'm still right here. There's no need to be. Explaining oh. for my behalf, and I'm still right here. Yeah, um, that's not what I'm talking about. It has nothing to do with money mm. at all. Mm. Um, I think for me, it doesn't matter. Even Samukawa, I talk about it all the time. We've talked about it so many times as a global <laughs> citizen now that we've moved on from that. Mm. Everybody still complains when he says things that are very harsh. Who's so everybody? people who, who digest the inform the, does information. Does it, does it He's not the first. Are you kidding me? Do you watch? Do you actually don't? And I, no, I don't, there's no point. Fair share. Are you kidding? Like that they did. It's yeah, fair share. So what are you talking about? Fine, it has nothing to do not with. As like a backlash. How do I? Put uh, it fair, now? it is backlash. Like they, backlash. Do you know how many times the they have like protested? In fact, do you know what we're trying to savage? Mm. Do you no, understand? Uh, no. Do you get what I mean? Do you not, no, no, that's not true. Guys, that that's is not true. Say things shay shay. with facts here. He's gone through a lot when of stuff. When Samuel Kamo first started, before. thank you, he has been sued. He's been dragged on internet and a in lot. person. As in, like, people the took to the, career, road, to the streets and were carrying plaques. So let's not let's not act like you see my problem with this conversation is that you guys want to make it something that it's not. Who is to who is to, um Shay Shay and who she isn't and who how we see her, how we don't what see her. Me, that's what, that's what I am saying to you guys to, on yeah, this exactly. table yeah, my point. that the way she said it was a little mean. No. And when something is a little mean, it's Very a little mean. There's so actually. many ways that you can say that stuff without saying it like that, in my opinion. So when you guys are addressing um, Shei Shei and who she is. You said you said that you're criticizing the viewers because that is not my concern. If she even if she was a complete stranger or she was Beyonce, my stance would still remain huh. in terms. In fact, <laughs> I would even be more <laughs> upset. <laughs> I would even be more upset if it came from somebody with more power because then your influence is even stronger. You can be nicer about a lot of things. You don't have to condemn the person to extreme poverty by sitting what? on a couch and asking that she would the person will never be able to make money like it's a, See, it's extreme sense of entitlement by nigerians is a so sense of entitlement annoying. I, do you know what that now, means let me tell you what the, let me tell you do you know what that means you know what entitlement See, means i'm, I'm, I'm like down. i don't understand See, be coming down eh be coming down now what i'm telling you about sense of entitlement is that everybody feels that when you go wrong because you are in one position i should come and tap you in Say you can do better, you can actually get there. Yeah. That's not the point. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you, what, what's wrong with you? No, dude, that really hurts. <laughs> I'll yeah. tell you, what's wrong with you? Go on, go do it like this. Now, that's what Shay Shay did. Do you understand? Now, did she use her right hand to pull the child? Because you were about to go for what? You were about to go for what? You were about to go for what? That was exactly, eh, yeah. that was exactly what she did. She slapped the guy with her left hand and pulled him close. See, that song, right? Only talent, oh. I mean, imagine somebody was telling somebody that see, I love you. You can do this one, but you cannot do this one. Call me for this one. Are you what else? What else? But we want to feel entitled okay, because so, I'm Shei so. Shei. Kids up and play voices. That boy was sounding like a duckling. No, I disagree with that. What are you saying? I disagree you with that. Your performance? I disagree with that. At I think moment, he knows. At the moment, I think he has a voice. He doesn't just know how to sing. I feel like with a few practices, that guy is good to go. Good a to few go. Practices. Yes, absolutely. Do you know how long it takes you before? The you last time I told you I could be a professional footballer, what did you tell me on this table? <laughs> I don't know, but it must have been no, funny. No, I don't know what it is. At this age, look at your tummy. No, that's you can't even make it. Was that no, what no, you no, told no. me? If I put Did that, I hold it against Put you? that conversation but in context. He said you could be the best. No, play. how this can guy, I say This I guy was telling us that you can do anything, anything, that impossible is not a thing, and that he can be anything he wants to be right now. All this kind of nonsense She not said, talk. can you still be a professional footballer? I said, why not if I train? No, he was not a professional. Me, you can even do it. You can move your body. Whatever. Did I die? Did I not come here and walk the next day? 
<laughs> did you not start? No, you were no, you were battered uh, emotionally uh, and spiritually. Uh, emotionally and psychologically. And psychologically you know, so now. Let's when, face when, it Emer now. when Emerald comes, we'll have that conversation because I know you're lying. I never said that you can't be a professional cook. You made you made it look like you're going to be the best in everything that you could be the best. So what are you talking whatever. about? How That's exactly I what I said to you that day. I said, I said, why would you for, for someone that's just starting you know, now with that in his thirties or whatever wants to compare to somebody who's been playing football from God knows when, but and then you want to compare but that. But I came to work the next day. How does that have to do with being the best this footballer on the earth? This guy now going to build himself and not coming to tweet that he's psychological. Is he, a go is, is he coming to work that make you the best footballer? What are you talking about? No, wow. you are not getting the point. I'm uh, not, but let's uh, move on because I don't you know. know. You're the one involved. That he said the get. point. His point is that he battered him psychologically and emotionally. emotionally. But and I see he came, came to work. work the next okay, so this day. guy will not come to work the next day. I don't this understand. This guy that said this... Make it make sense, um, uh, please. Um, uh, if you are watching this show, call Sheyishe. Milk this that is happening to you right now. And get Sheyishe to give your son writing due. If you cannot sing, you can write, my brother. Okay, write. That, on that note, I think we all agree to that statement. Yeah. Moving on, popular Nigerian actress Ruth Kadiri has come for her colleagues who intend on campaigning for politicians in the next general election. Talking, uh, taking to her Instagram rather, the movie star warns them to abort the plans now or else they would have to face the wrath. The mother of one further noted that it is only desperation and poverty that will make some of her, some of them agree to campaigning for politicians who have been in power for so long and don't want to retire. The actress also pleaded with them to respect their integrity and refuse to be a sellout. End of Please, what? I have a question for all of you. Yes. Please, how many people used to handle you like Dote's account? <laughs> because for some way, someone is inside that comment section. Do you like this? <laughs> <laughs> Do you like this? <laughs> <laughs> right on, sister. Why can't he say that? No, no, I'm just, it's just, it's just bands, right? It's everywhere. <laughs> Whenever there's a comment about, oh, oh make Nigeria mana. Is it mana? Yeah, mana. Make. It like this? No, sorry. Nah, make Nigeria Manga. great. Manga. Manga. I don't know, man. Yeah. Unga. Unga. Yeah. Make Nigeria great again. Yeah, but inside. You let you change always somewhere like this. Like this. But you don't get them now. You don't get them now. You don't get them now. Unga. Unga. Make Nigeria great. Unga. Is it bona? Unga. Unga. Now you boom man, now you be out the next person. But let's talk about politics, what? really. What? <laughs> I don't talk that one, no. Mm? God will bless us with the best. Amen. Anyways, what I'm going to tell you is that um, politics in Nigeria, a lot of us, um, a lot of us, yes, yes, I'm speaking from the chest right now. A lot of us are really, 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 really confused and tired because mm. we keep saying we want change. We keep saying we want change and we keep seeing the support that goes out to the people that have been feeding us nonsense. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. That is why I keep saying we are confused and tired. Mm. Now, somebody went to celebrate, I don't know who, celebrate uh, birthday somewhere. Somebody. somebody went to celebrate. Shake the table if mm. I see. My somebody went table? To Somebody went, to somebody went to celebrate birthday somewhere. It's not and we so. saw... Everywhere. And we were wondering, why this the sudden support... The former governor of Lagos State went to celebrate birthday in Kenya. Uh, I don't in know what you are talking about. I'm talking about somebody. Uh, yeah. That's me, I know. I don't know who you, you are talking about. It's Bola Ahmed Tenubu. Bola Ahmed. Is yeah. that what you know? We say what you know. Who celebrates birthday with the own, My guy, with the own Nigeria the shit? <laughs> Who celebrates birthday with the The only news way they more important than the celebration of Bola Ahmed Tinubu's birthday you know, I, was I to... it's about our Nigerian president taking a trip again to the overseas. After they just said that they will not let them travel in. My brother, don't worry. I, I don't yourself. understand how these things happen. No, it's okay, it's okay. They just said they will uh -uh. not allow people to travel for medical health care. They are going to build the Nigerian health care system. Before, blah, blah, we were saying that here we did, but actually a lot of people that don't see why that. see. We are now very, very confused. They say we should talk. We cannot talk. They will arrest us. They say we should fight for our rights. If we fight for it, they will arrest us. They say we should stand our ground. Do if we stand arrest? our ground, they will put they us to the now. ground. Did they, they, they arrest? Yes, now the, the last. No, no, they arrested. They arrested. They say we should stand our ground. They will put us to the ground. 
Do you understand? They say we should go for politics. Wait, wait, wait. Do, 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 do. Wait, 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 please, in. please. Let me warn you. Please don't ever do that around me. What? They say we should they say we should stand our ground. I am a motivation speaker. Wait, 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 wait. What they say we should with? they say we should stand our ground, but they put we'll us to the ground. ground. Don't do that name. I aspire to peace fire. Please don't do that. If you want to start your career, make I go out. They say we should stand firm and they send us to the farm. Please get out of this room. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Anyways, the bottom yeah. line is, look, we're really confused. And I think as, we as, as, as the, you know, how do I put them now? The senior citizens that are speaking to the younger gen, they are not even doing well enough. Because I will see a man that stood by me during the end SARS and will be endo I know somebody, I know people in fact. And we'll be endorsing somebody that they feel should not be in power. Especially when you go back to their old post. They'll be endorsing that person and making that person look like that's the best thing for Nigeria. Mm. So, see, we are now confused because the people we look up to are the ones confusing us. Do you understand? Because they make us feel like, yes, you guys can do this, you guys can achieve this. But as soon as one old man crawls out from wherever old he comes from to come and say he wants to be the president, they will be the ones right behind yes, him and holding him when he's about down. to fall. But you see, you see, see sad. You see, um, you need to, it's not even rocket science, right? First things first, it's like the A, B, C, no even reach of politics, right? They keep Nigerians impoverished. Mm. And the one thing that Nigerians want the most is money and comfort, right? So when it's time for elections, they come out with what you want the most. Mm. Forget about the sweet talk. Everybody knows that they know when they hear lies. Mm. Do you understand know what I mean? But, bro, oh, see, it's your reality, my G. Oh, see, Jam, you haven't eaten. You know? Like, you probably, you're probably eating like maybe five times in the last one week. And one dude is offering you breakfast, lunch, and supper for the next one week. Do you understand? Oh my God. You know, you're educated. And you're not just, nobody's educated as in just going to school. Like, you're mentally educated. You know? You know that if you don't mind starving yourself. A bit. A for bit. The, for the for greater, the greater, greater yeah. good. But and that in itself, that kind not, of thinking, see, you can't do it on an empty stomach either. Bro, exactly. <laughs> Hey. Hey. No matter so you what I mean, I for me. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because yeah. Ruth Carter is out here speaking. Uh, but yeah, I understand she's, she's what she's saying. Right people, it though. makes sense. These guys can think it about that. It makes sense. But you see, can we, can we how far would it go, though? Point, I just knew you were trying to make reference to Bernard Boyd. How? Then that you were somewhere I, in your honestly, conversation. Yes, it was. Yeah. Yes, so it how, was. How? Now, nah, which excuse me. <coughs> with Dele, Momo Chief Dele, mm. Momoji. And um, what he said was that, look, if Bonobo, that he ne we need to understand that this is politics and this is, um, what's it called now? Right. People that want to gain something. It is a business. As a musician, you want to make money. Do you understand? So That's the reason. That, wait, 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 hold music. on. Hold on. Exactly. He said that like, some people will call out media organizations that you're running an advert for this company. But I started this organization because I need to make money and I have staff working for me and I'm Obviously. going to pay them. Obviously. So it doesn't mean that if I'm running an, an advert placement for PDP, APC, DCC, MPC, whatever, it doesn't mean that if one of them should misbehave tomorrow as an organization, the media organization is supposed to speak the truth and won't call them out. Mm -hmm. But you came to drop advert on me. So that thing made me make sense of the old Bonner Boy situation that look, it's a business. This guy is trying to make money. It doesn't mean that if Governor Wiki tomorrow goes wrong, but now Boy will not be the first to go and sing about him in his music. Yeah. Do you understand? I, I mean, I guess so, but I think she's still saying she's still speaking facts because. I'm going to collect your money if you have, have to, man. If they mess up, call them out. I disagree. I think actors. Oh. And Eat, celebrities bro. and influencers or whatever, you have a very strong responsibility to play. Um, and you have to be careful. If you don't mean it, if you don't trust the person, I don't think you should accept that. And especially because you're not the kind of person that you were explaining that hasn't eaten in one week and the money's going to come, okay? So we're not going to argue like as if, no, you are that desperate. Sometimes just no, value. No, No, I think you can do, you won't die. If you but don't, if you don't lead the whole country sorry, um, into, but we need to round up. Let me just say my take because you guys have. We don't need to, to we don't need to run the whole country <laughs> into a four, five, four year, if not eight year term of poverty because you wanted some cash that's not going to last you that long. Mm. But let's Thank you.